Hi guys, it is me, Adam, and welcome back to another Clash Royale video. And today in this video, we're going to be live battle like usual. And guess what, guys? By using this deck that I created with a little bit of help from Daniel, shout out to Red right here. And he's a year nine, like I said last yesterday. Yeah, shout out to him. He helped me with this deck. But I added a few things myself. So by using this deck, I managed to push all the way to 2,406 trophies, which is not my trophy record just yet. But still though, oh, I don't feel good. I am recording now. Anyway, um, oh yeah, make sure you go check out Dark Dragon's channel. Um, he has a channel himself. Uh, he had, now he has two videos. He just uploaded one and he uploaded another one last time. And also go subscribe to Jamaican Bacon. He also has another YouTube channel. He just made a video today. And if you can't find him, you can go to one of my videos. He commented on one of them. And you can go to his channel. So anyway, guys, let's go for some battles. And hopefully we can continue to win. And possibly beat our trophy record here. So we are facing Bob here or Bube from Legion Disparu. I think he's French from the clan flag. So, um, yeah. Alright, we're going to start with the bomber here. He's a level 9, so he does have an advantage over me. Alright. I'm going to put in that hog rider to combo with that bomber. And he puts in a minion horde. Easy counter there. Alright. Quite self-explanatory here. With the minion horde to counter my hog. And okay, so right now he is leading, but keep in mind that he's a level 9. And oh no. Oh no. No, 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 no. That is not good. Not good, guys. Oh, look at the push on that right side, though. So low cost. Yeah, we did so much damage there with the Ice Spirit freezing the tower as well. And okay, this is gonna be very, very tough. Like, very, very, very tough. I don't know how I'm going to deal with this. Okay. Alright. I think we could be screwed. We could be completely screwed here. I don't I, I don't think I can deal with this. I don't know how. I can't deal with that. Yep, I think that's the tower. Like, I can't do anything. I can't do anything, guys. Like, that is an unstoppable push with the cards that I have. I can't do anything. Are you kidding me? I don't have a zap. Are you kidding me, man? I don't have a zap now. Not at this time, mate. I need the zap now. Oh, for God's sake. Come on, mini pack up. At least take out that tower. Yes. All right. He took out that tower. But here we go again with another lava hound here. So this is how starting to make me very vulnerable here to the lava hound. Um, all right. We managed to take his king tower down very low, though. So that could be our advantage here. It's Lava House charging in. I won't be surprised to see that Inferno Dragon. Yep, there it is. There is that Inferno Dragon. There are those Barbarians as well. They're, those are going to cause havoc as well. And this is very, very bad here, guys. I don't know how I'm going to counter that. Here, yeah, this is a very, very strong push. And okay, we did. We screwed. I don't know how I'm going to counter that. I really can't counter it. It's literally at this point, if I can get that his tower. That's the only chance I have at winning this match. Literally, and then I'm not gonna get it. I'm not gonna get it in time. You see, what on earth? I can't. How am I supposed to counter that? I can't counter it. What? Ugh. Just as I was winning a lot of battles, getting a win streak. Well, yeah, all right. Shout out to Red again and Jamaican Bacon since they just said hi to YouTube. But what on earth, Supercell? How can you match me up with that guy when I literally don't have the troops to counter it? I can't counter that. He has the Inferno Dragon behind the Lava Hound and the Barbarians to counter my Inferno. I can't do that. How am I supposed to counter it? Alright, another battle then. And okay. Alright, we are facing Ryan Nguyen from Vietnam Nol. Uh, I'm going to point our Hall Rider and start this off. Oh my god, not a Goblin Heart. I hate Goblin Hearts. I hate the f all the flipping spawners whenever they have one. Barbarian Hearts to Tombstones, I hate all of them. Come on. Mini Pekka. There we go. Please don't go for the Goblin Hub. Please don't go for the Goblin Hub. Please don't go. Yes. Oh, no. Stupid barbarians. They, yeah, they, went, they went in the way, man. Oh, for God's sake. And there goes my bomber. Isn't that great? 
Alright, it's gonna be a big push then. Of course, of course you had to counter to it, right? Oh yes, what a zap! Brilliant zap there! Yes, look at the damage! Look at that damage, that is what we're talking about. Alright. The Goblin Heart is still so annoying though. I hate the Goblin Heart. Alright, we're gonna put in Spear Goblins here. Alright, can, can someone please take out that Goblin Heart? It's getting annoying now. It's just getting annoying now. Take it out, please. Thank you. That's, thank you very much. Okay, that's very good. Okay, very good. I don't know why I'm speaking with this weird accent, but... Eh, so be it. Oh my god, the amount of troops that are coming my way, man. It's not good. Why is the witch taken back? Why did you go the other way, witch? Why, why did you have to turn back? Come on, hug, go! Go, huggy, go! No! No, the stupid skeleton army got to you! Stupid skeleton army, man. Skeleton army, like, really got buffed well, like... Now, I've seen everybody using skeleton army now with... Because, because of the high level, the, the skeleton army is really became a terror, like Supercell say. Oh my god, he just rocketed that, are you kidding me? He was so desperate to flipping save his... Oh my god, I don't even understand that. He... Oh my god, no! No! No, he's got a spoiler attack. I'm so... Uh, no, I'm, I'm already crying already. I'm crying already. Plus he's got a rocket. I, why, why haven't I mentioned that yet? Oh, I'm screwed! He's got... Oh. I can't count. I'm, I'm dead. Again. Spawner deck, man! Everybody hates spawners! Oh, another rocket. Are you kidding me? You know, this guy could just rocket me to death. He could just use two rockets and he would already win. Oh my god. A giant push, mate. Giant, gi gigantic push. Oh, it's over. All he has to do is rocket me once. That's all he has to do. It's over. He's just waiting. He's just waiting for the rocket. I already know it. He's got the rocket in hand. He already knows what he's going to do. He, he already knows, guys. It's so obvious to him. He's already won. Oh, it's all. Yep. He's got it. He, he's got the rocket. He doesn't even want to finish me with the rocket is the funny part. <laughs> all right, there we go. Prince has got it. Don't you even dare. No. Arrogant people, man. Arrogant people. Uh, Alright, let's go for another battle then. And so far, we've been losing everything. I mean, I wasn't that mad about the first one. But I was even more mad about the second one since I was facing somebody arrogant. Right, we're going to put in spear goblins. Okay. Okay, all right, we cycle through. We need the Infernal Tower now. And right, I'm gonna put the Infernal Tower. All right, that's good. The Valkyrie's gonna get taken out as well. You can put a Goblin there, all right, that's fine. Okay, we're doing good, we're doing good, okay. Goblins. And then let's go with the push now. Here we go, guys. It is a pretty good push. And all right, we're doing some major damage here to his Crown Tower. It's a very good start for us. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to title this video the best deck for, for pushing the arena a V3 because I already made two and I think this is another very very good deck for pushing the arena 8. It only took me like yeah, it, yeah, it really did help me there. It really helped me push back the arena 8 after I lost like my bowler deck. Alright, uh, Inferno. Oh my god, that that push though. That push though. Mini Pekka. Oh my god, the goblins got in the way, you stupid goblins! Oh my god! No! The Sparky was gonna target the Inferno, and my goblins got in the way, so my Sparky flip. so the Sparky flipping attack. The oh, I forgot to say. Alright, you know what? It's fine. It's fine, alright? Never do that ever again. Never put goblins in front of a flipping Sparky. Sorry guys, I had to pause the video for a moment because somebody went 
in my kind of came in my room so um yeah anyway we're gonna start again with another battle and by the way i won that battle by the way uh one to zero i got it in overtime he actually got another sparky shot and he managed to get the one crown but then i managed to get him back in overtime uh making me the winner so yeah <laughs> so anyway need to focus on this battle now okay all right inferno we need a little bit of this oh wait this is, the hog didn't get pulled oh my god the hog didn't get pulled the hog was supposed to get pulled by the inferno all right so he did some quite quite a bit of damage there because the hog didn't go for the inferno all right minion uh mega minions should be just fine all right, we're gonna put in our hog with the goblins. We are lagging a little bit here. There is a little bit of lag. That's not good. That is never a good thing. All right, there we go. All right, one five eight five health on his crown tower here, and we are seriously lagging here. Like lag is real here. All right. All right, he's gonna put fire spirits. That's gonna take out my mini pekka. And oh my god, my screen's frozen. Oh my god. Hold on, somebody's on the phone. Hold on. Alright guys, we are back and I had to go downstairs. And oh my god, somebody's calling again. We are back right now. Thank you guys for watching this video. Um I know I just had to like cut off the video because somebody walked into my room. But anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you have and make sure you comment if you have any suggestions. So anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video and I'll see you guys next time. Peace guys, see ya.